there is a chi a b c d okay so one thing one property you need to know about chi's is that um they have identical angles at some points here so this part would be considered an isosceles if you were to split this in half so hence this would be also 111 degrees meaning instantly we can work out this angle by summing all the interior angles which add up to 360 by the way because it's four-sided and we can work out this one so work out size angle abc oh there we go that's exactly what we need to do so find this angle here so in your calculator just pretty much add up these sides so 90 plus 111 plus extra 111 and then subtract that from 360 so let's do that 90 plus 22 so i got 312 and then minus it from 360 you should get 48 degrees simple let's just put 48 here okay part b let's check it out so two of these kites are arranged so that the shorter side of one of the kites is placed on top of the shorter side of the other kite as shown below so these are the same kites by the way they're both a b c d kites so just to make it clear i think it's best we just label it right now so cut down a few steps so 48 degrees we know this whole one here is 111 and this one's also 111 but it's been split by 19x meaning 90 plus x is 111 therefore if you subtract 90 you should just get 21 so this is 21 degrees okay let's keep going so work outside angle x okay we did that it's 21 degrees work outside of y okay so let's keep going so we need to figure out what this one is so we should know the value of this angle here i believe we have it previously right 111 yeah because it's just been rotated it's still the same size so this angle must also be 111 and one thing to know is that this shape here is actually a pentagon so it's a five-sided shape so if you know if you don't know the sum of the of, of the interior angles of pentagon you could always use this formula here which is n the number size minus 2 times 180 will give you the exact number total and number of angles inside the or the sum of all the interior angles of uh, any polygon so pentagon is five sided, so n is five, so it'd be five minus two is three times one eighty should give us I think it's five forty, yep, five forty degrees. This means that all of these must add up to five forty. So we can just subtract it from five forty. So we've got 90, 90, 100, 111 equals plus y equals five forty. So we've got ninety, two loss of those, so twice plus two loss of one hundred and eleven plus y equals 540 degrees if you add up all of these ones we've got 2 times 90 plus 2 times 111 so i'll go 402 degrees here plus y subtract 402 from 540 and you should get 138 degrees